Southern Nevada is rolling out the red carpet for two projects, big studios that could start producing some big budget films here by 2027. This effort is being supported by a massive tax incentive and infrastructure bill proposed by state lawmakers yesterday, and that includes $190 million in tax credits annually for 20 years. Sean Kalafi gives us a first look at the Las Vegas Media Campus project in the works in the southwest part of the city. Las Vegas is stepping into the spotlight in the film industry, with plans for two large studios coming to the Valley and a proposed tax incentive and infrastructure bill to help with the transition. One studio site, the Las Vegas Media Campus, will be built near the Durango Resort and Casino by California-based Bircher Development in partnership with UNLV. And an even bigger Sony Pictures studio is planned somewhere in Summerlin with the Howard Hughes Corporation. Both projects are forecasted to create thousands of jobs for Nevada. There's going to be between eight to 10,000 construction jobs over the next five years created. And in addition to that, when the two studio zones are fully deployed and open, there'll be uh, over 6,800 uh, or more uh, full-time jobs on campus. And attract people from out of state as well. I think it also supplements the tourism industry in our state because you know how people go to Hollywood, just go to the studios to Paramount and to Sony and to Universal Studios. That could happen in Nevada as well. The Las Vegas Media Campus will include 15 sound stages and an education center to train future film industry workers. And we're going to be teaching really the next generation of Nevadans all about every aspect of the film industry. And uh, we're going to be manning that building, and uh, part of the 30% tax credit is going to fund that initiative. UNLV President Keith Whitfield says it will give students a chance to jumpstart their careers in film and related industries. Both projects are expected to cost upwards of $800 million, but the tax credits won't come until the first film is produced. The studio could be open for blockbuster business in 2027. Shauna Kalafi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. So if the bill is passed, developers of the Las Vegas Media Campus project say agreements with the governor's office could be signed by this fall, followed by around 18 months of design and permit work, and then construction could start as soon as spring of 2025, estimated to take one and a half to two years.